he had to go change his shirt. Feel better now? That's your wrinkle shirt. That was too wrinkly, ain't it? <laughs> Take two. Let's try another one. Okay, guys, look who's back. What's going on, guys? Same shirt that he started off with. It's, it's called some. the. It's the husband and wife tag My challenge bad. video or something. Alright, let's start. Okay, <clears throat> so. <laughs> You're weird. Okay. How and where did we meet? We met at the mall. Um, you walked up to me and told me your first and last name like a weirdo. I introduced myself to you. That's what and I said, normal people and do. And I said... <laughs> so, let's elaborate on this question really quick. When, what, do you remember like the first time you ever saw me? No. Because I remember the That first was my first recollection, recollection of seeing you when you I remember the first time I ever saw Devin. I remember what he was wearing. I remember where he was standing. I was immediately attracted to him. So, I hope that makes you feel like crap. No, it makes you feel like a psycho. <laughs> question number two. Let me ask you a question. Okay. Hmm. How did you know I was the one? Mm. Why do we have to get so deep so quick? That's what she said. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. How was our first date? How was it? Yes, how was our first date? Our Well, okay. <clears throat> the first time me and Devin hung out by ourselves was really awkward. He invited me to go watch a movie <laughs> with him. Well, it was, and uh, it was Think Like a Man. Yeah, Think Like a Man. And I liked Devin at this time, but there were other friends that were supposed to be coming with us, and then they ended up bailing on us. And now looking back, I think they did that on purpose. We were watching the movie, and Devin's back was like this to me the whole time, with his arms crossed. And I was just like, really? That's a sign. That means I love you. I was like, what a meanie. I offered to take Devin out for his birthday. And I got him a birthday present, a watch, and his dog ended up chewing up the watch like the day after I got it. I still have the watch though. Okay. <laughs> and you made me a nice bag. She put these little glitter letters on the bag in my I name. I did. Oh, it was a good day. <laughs> and then he ended up paying for my meal on his birthday. Shivery is not dead, ladies. We out here. This is a good question. If you baked me a cake, 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 cake what kind would I like? Okay. I'm gonna say strawberry cake with cream cheese frosting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really wrong. Strawberry cake with buttercream frosting. What? Y'all? Yeah. <laughs> it's the same thing. <laughs> no, it's not. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, what about me? Wait, let me think. Okay. Wait, let me think. Okay. If I were to make you a cake, it would totally be chocolate cake. Cause you like chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm just funny. laughs> okay, skip the question. <laughs> you don't know. What is my favorite restaurant? Your favorite restaurant? Waffle House. Damn it! <laughs> um, Huey oh. Louis. Okay, that's one of them. But, not because it's my favorite restaurant, just because they serve my favorite dish, which is... Fish tacos. Eh. Shrimp Be more tacos. Specific. French. I mean... <laughs> um, Baja fish tacos. I'm sorry. Get it Baja right. Baja fish tacos. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then, what's my favorite thing to eat, like, in general? Um, Baja fish tacos. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm gonna guess Devin's favorite restaurant. And I'm gonna I say don't even this. Know it. I do. Oh. Anything that has a dollar menu is Devin's favorite restaurant. What do I order at the dollar menu? <laughs> Anytime we go to a restaurant, he tells me which menu to order from. He Are orders we signing up for those emails for every restaurant? Get those coupons. Get that free burger for your birthday. Have five birthdays. 
What is your most repeated phrase or sentence? Uh, okay, so should I guess it? Okay, that's yours. Okay, <laughs> that's how you break a sentence. Okay. What other one? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> And talking with your hands like this when you mad. Then I tell you take that trash out. <laughs> Why is it dishes in the sink? Alright. If you could be any dinosaur, which one would it be? Are you making this crap up? Nope. <laughs> well. I would want to be... I really now know. Now be careful now. I really know. They're extinct. If had to be a dinosaur, it would be the one with a really long neck. But Since eight leaves. So when you can be, when you're at the gas station, you don't gotta go. Uh, can I have a uh, ten on pump? <laughs> you can just kind of ten on pump. No, let me tell you why. Because they're <laughs> graceful. They don't hurt other dinosaurs, and the T-Rex can't eat them because they're bigger than the T-Rex. But you notice they're always single. They can't get no man. You don't know that. <laughs> Have you ever seen Land Before Time? <laughs> Next. So, now that we've like joked around for the first part of the video, we're gonna actually answer some serious questions. Um, so here's one. What key elements make a successful relationship or marriage? And I know mine. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, I think we can both agree like the first most important thing is to put God first. And I'm not trying to sound cliche, but it really is super important. And I think trust is number two. Like, literally, that is probably the, the because everything about a relationship, whether it's a friendship, whether it's a marriage, whether it's um, you know a re relationship. Any relationship is built on trust. It is. It is built on trust, and that's one thing that me and Devin 100% have. Like, we do not keep the secrets from each other like don't, she don't go through my, my phone his, i don't go through her phone his thumbprint can open my phone i don't even have a lock on my phone i never had um, a phone. yeah it's like those things like we have trust 100 percent and and also just being affectionate towards each other well, i think and i think right, right right up there with trust is communication yeah that's a good one too i think communication just like in, in just like trust with any relationship it makes it prosper a little more yeah. Being able to talk to each other. And that's something that we've had to work on, too. Communication. Yeah. Yeah. So, definitely, you know. Because I speak Spanish. So, the last question is probably one that I feel like we should answer, just so people can kind of understand, you know, our establishment and whatever. And it is, how long have we been together, relationship and marriage? So. We've been together. So, our two-year wedding anniversary was actually October 11th. This year, we got married on in 2014, mm -hmm. and we've been together since 2008. June 8th, July 8th. July 8th, because your birthday's June. Sorry, July 8th. Eight is our lucky number for real. Everything happens on the eighth, but July 8th of 2012. So. <laughs> um, That's I hope. <laughs> That's I hope all, that y'all enjoyed this video. Go ahead and comment, subscribe to our channel if you want to see more. Give us a comment down below. Let us know what you want to see. Y'all have a blessed day from the Dusomes.